In order to deliver on time a mature product, Airbus is putting in place a strong chain of tests. It starts first with aircraft minus one, which is used to develop and validate the man-machine interfaces. The second step is performed here in this engineering simulator called Aircraft Zero. This is the first engineering simulator equipped with actual aircraft displays and actual aircraft boxes. It is where we are going to validate, to integrate the various parts coming from the various suppliers all around the world. It will prepare the first flight of our first aircraft prototype which will be, of course, the beginning of the flight tests necessary in order to deliver on time an aircraft certified and mature for operation. The role of Ironbird in A350 cross wide body de development is to integrate uh, hydraulic systems, uh, electric systems, and uh, flight control system for development and certification testing. So last year was the power run and pressure run these were steps for the commissioning of the Iron Bird. That means we tested all the systems in order to validate the, the Iron Bird itself. Now AIS means that the official test has begun and we produce results to design office on uh, different systems. Aircraft Zero is, an, uh, is the coupling between Iron Bird and the cockpit simulator, which enable a test pilot to prepare the first flight and to do more certification tests with a better configuration. The main benefits for Airbus of merging Ironbird and Cockpit Simulator into Aircraft Zero is to integrate more systems together. For example, on Ironbird, we already test uh, electrical system, hydraulic system, flight control systems, and we add uh, over real system like every human machine interface uh, to enable pilots to perform virtual flights.